And here, as you can see, if we type the command plot, followed by the name of the set, so let's try with lost origin, as you can see here, and then we click enter, in a matter of a second, we'll get our response. And as you can see here, we got the private message from the bot, and we have the chart with the number of listings, so the supply, in this case, is lost origin booster boxes. And then down here, we also have the chart with the medium price over time, obviously, and then the average of the four lowest prices. Hello, people. This is Barry from Bear Collector. And no, uh, you were not dreaming. I did say something big was happening on the channel. And this is it. There is a Discord bot that is going to be available on the Discord. And the link is in the description down below. That for now, and I'm saying for now because this is basically, it's not even a beta version. It's more of a... Hey guys, I made this. Let's test it. F find me the bugs. I'll I'll improve it. Let me know what you guys want me to do, and I'll make those adjustments. So that's kind of what's happening now. And as you saw from the intro, what does it do? So there now there are free commands. They're gonna be in the Discord, so you're gonna be able to read them. So you can also use them yourself. The command list, which gives you a list of all available data sheets. So basically. If you want to plot, let's say, as you saw in the example of storage and booster boxes, you want to see the amount of supply available in the market. This is car market data, so in the European market. And again, this is only car market data. If we grow large enough, then we can also try and implement this for other platforms. Then the list will let you know what are the available product for now. And then you have the plot sheet name, which is what you saw in the intro, which plots the supply and the average price of the four lowest listed on car market as basically what you've seen in the video. And then we have the suggestion command, which is basically a Barrett look, uh, can we add this? Can we add that product? Can you perhaps make this command that will implement this other function, so on and so forth. So basically, it's an open book. You're just going to write your suggestion after the command, as it says, exclamation point, suggestion, and then your suggestion. And then it's going to respond to you. Thank you for your suggestion. It has been noted. So you know that it was actually recorded. Once you query the bot for the first time on the chat, on the public chat in the Discord, you can then do your own queries via private messages. And all of your answers will be via private messages. So you're going to query the bot on the chat and it's going to send you a PM with the answer. Now, Again, you see what kind of charts are available for now? Well, the same that you've seen in the intro. And again, I'm all ears. I'm hoping this will do well so we can improve it together. And uh, obviously, you know, I've talked about this, but I haven't mentioned how you can access it. I said it's in the Discord. I didn't say how you could access. I didn't say how much it was. I didn't talk about membership. And uh, so you may ask, okay, Barrett, this is nice. It's a nice tool. There are similar products out there where you can track prices and so on and so forth. I don't know if there are type of products where you can track supply, but how much is it? Absolutely free. Why? Well, mainly because I, it's not something I want to sell. It's a way of saying thank you for those who have been supporting me in this journey so far. As I've always preached, I'm a mathematician. I don't do this full time. I'm a full time student and I try to pass on to my knowledge to you guys. This is part of a skill set that I had to have, I'm required to have as a mathematician, a bit of coding and obviously problem solving. And I just want to hopefully help you guys out. And again, if I fit back, I can then make those adjustments and improve this product. Now the Excel sheet that you might have seen in one of my previous video, if you are been around in the channel, you sure already know it. It's still obviously in my possession, it's going to remain in my possession. But this way you can extract the data from it. And as you can see, I do also collect much more data than what I chart for now. So I will be able to make those adjustments, those improvements along the way. Now, I did say that this could revolutionize the way we look at plugin investing. I know what you think about it. I'm not aware of any, at least in the European Union, any product, any software, let's say, that keeps track of supply, of a given item. And again, I'm doing this for Pokemon. I can do this for any item that I would like to, but it's currently available. So that is why I did say, and I do think 
this is quite groundbreaking. And this hopefully kind of gives you an idea of who I am. I do seem young and I am. Sometimes what I say could be confusing, but hopefully this will give you a rough idea of the type of skill set that I have. So there is a catch and the catch is as this product is free and I'm broke, I'm really broke. I, I have all my money in Pokemon. And again, I'm not looking to profit off of this. This will not be able to run 24 seven because I will need a VPS, a virtual private server to have around 24 seven. So you could query the, the database through the bot 24 seven. So it'll all be available when I will be online because it requires my computer to be online. So I'll try to, to let you guys know when I'll be online on the discourse. You can hopefully make the best out of this tool. And I personally consider a fair trade as I'm not asking for any money. And obviously I'm not providing something that is operating 24 seven and that does look like a, a professional product. So all of this will be available. So all of this will be already available as you're watching this video. So all you have to do is again, join the Discord. The link is down below. It's completely free. Hope to see you there. And I would highly appreciate if you could leave me down a comment what you think about this. If you already have some improvements in mind that, that could be made. And obviously if you don't want to miss out on any update, then I highly recommend you click the subscribe button. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like. It really goes a long way for the YouTube algorithm. I hope to see you in the Discord. Hope to see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.